Hi, it's Johnson. I'm going to talk about the customizing the look of the start menu. So, you go to it by right-clicking the start menu and picking properties. And then you get this, this screen. And you can lock the toolbar, auto-hide it, like so. Un-auto-hide it. You could use small icons or big ones, like so. Or you could set the tool bar to bottom, left, right, or top, like that. So, yeah. I'm gonna put it. And you can also customize the buttons to combine one taskbar full, like this. Or never combine or always combine and hide the text label label and you can edit the notification area to show icons and notification hide the icons and notification and only show notification by picking from the drop down bar and uh, for the system icons, you could turn them on and off in the system tray. Like clock, on, off, volume, on, off, and network and action center. And I'll pick something like this. And that's all. I'm going to talk about the start menu and toolbars next. In the start menu tab, you can customize if the, the headings are a menu or a link. A menu is something like this, where it shows all the items inside of the heading, like computer, the drives and stuff. So a link is like just a link to your folder and don't display this item, just hides it. So you can also set it to default settings. And for the power button action, which is this, you could set it to shut down and all these things. And this to store and display recently opened programs in the start menu and this to store recently opened items in the start menu and the taskbar. So for the two parts you could set them to display or not by checking or unchecking them. So thanks for watching and good night.